The next tool is the cut tool, or you're selecting a, an area of interest of the x-ray. And so if I'm concentrating on fixing the bow of the tibia, I would then choose my osteotomy site somewhere in this level. This would go into the planning, which will be another exercise. And I select the tool, and I outline the object that I would like to move or manipulate. At this point, if I go back and touch my selection tool, and touch my selection tool, it outlines and highlights the, the area I just selected, and I can move it in space. If I want to rotate it, it will rotate in the center of the object. Now, if I want to go back, and now I'm back to where I have unselected my object, I will then select my object again. Very fast, very easy. And then if I hit my select tool with what we call the thumbtack or the hinge point, it's this object, then I can select and it gives me a hinge point. I can grab this hinge point and manipulate it and I'm going to rotate the object at that point if I consider that the apex of my deformity. We'll go through the planning methods to accurately define that, but just, as, just to let you know how the tools work. You would then grab your rotation arrows and you rotate the bone around your hinge point and giving you the correction. At least you can uh, identify what it would look like after this type of correction. 